money. Houston, I see a console. Several sensors are detectable around it. Don't trigger those sensors. Shoot. I think those are in a closed system. Ghost, can you trigger the sensors? Shoot. Roger, roger. They said multiple sensors. I see two. But okay. I can't shoot them, so let's go in. Alarm. 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 One. Automatic defense procedure initiated. So, get blue. So, if no, no, I have to go out of here, trigger it again, I think. But it's dead now, or resting. Alarm level each room has its own a level of alarm. The higher the level is, the more defense Nakamura will use. Boom, level two room. So if I go back here, nope, it's not, it's not activated. I was thinking about grinding some energy cubes, but I guess not. So we we are gonna do. Oh wait, I killed him. Oops. Can I damage myself? Nope. Access the zone that requires a blue access Found the blue card. security card. Good job, Ghost. Proceed ahead. Oh, wait a minute. Let's got to jump around a bit, see if I can get some zones, but nope. Jupiter, welcome back, man. How are you? Doing good, I hope. That's wait. Oh, this is yeah. This is where I started. And I jumped to the left. Now we can open this door. Continue. was also level 2, but it was only these maiden defense robots. Getting close. But yeah, this is what I put points on, so it's gonna be they were hacking the room faster. I don't really need that. I guess the longer it takes, the more enemies I can kill and grind Open more sesame. Uh, energy cubes. Alarm There we go, we're in the tunnel room again. I wonder, can I take over these big ones? Nope, they have to have some sort of intelligence. But I can't really do anything with those. Yep, 
Here we go. Tutorial completed. Again. <laughs> so yeah guys, I'm gonna re-upload these videos to YouTube. Uh, with this playthrough, I have one already, but I changed the difficulty. And I'm gonna change the setup on my abilities. Go from there. Oh, I can't get in that door. Good news. Enter and unlock it, so we can continue from here if your body is destroyed. Acknowledged. Yeah, it would be nice. Oh, I destroyed my body, I get a new one. Can and the parents say. Chief. You don't need <laughs> guidance. Just choose the fanciest hallway or something. You mean select randomly? Yes. We'll be the first ones to map the Nakamura Space Station. There we go. Now we have the map at least. So Yeah, let's map it again. already seen the map oh I have to remove yeah we're gonna activate all these <coughs> alarms Alarm. clear them and out as much as we can and kind of do it from time to oh, time that's not good they know you're there get more cubes Also, lock from the inside, okay. Oh, there's the robot down here isn't here anymore because it's on easy. On harder difficulties, there are more enemies, <laughs> and I was gonna go down and control that body and clear this out, but okay. Guess not. Kinda easy anyway. Here we got a control. We're gonna map up the whole place again and look for... Houston, I'm in some sort of supply room? Looks like it. Talk to the robot. Try to get information. And please be very polite. Do not target him with your gun. I'm okay. on it. Greetings. Welcome to the supply room. I haven't seen you here before. Uh, no. You're a new model here in Nakamura. I am a new model here in Nakamura. Oh, finally! Some fresh silicon. 
Is there any technology I can offer? Uh, yeah, sure. The Naka AI algorithm would be nice. I might be short on cash, though. <laughs> <laughs> it is good to see that the new models finally include a sense of humor. There is no money in Nakamura. Everything is free. Take whatever you need. Anything? No limit? What's the catch? Well, dispensers need energy cubes to print devices. You can get whatever you like as long as you have the energy cubes for it. Let's see, your gun shots an extra seeking shot that... Oh wait, an extra? Oh... I didn't even read this one right yesterday. I thought it was like... It's shooting seeking shots. That deals 50% less damage. I thought every shot was dealing less damage. Energy cubes are used to print power-ups and weapon. Pick them up quick. Energy depleters over time. Increase the damage done by your main gun by two. Yeah, so we're gonna go and try to upgrade damage and stuff like that before we go to the boss this time. Um, Because a small container at your target spawning a flying mine that will explode when close damaging anything nearby. Choose damaging waves that go through enemies. Choose, choose beams that instantly goes through all enemies. But yeah, I'm really I really want this one. And I guess that one. So I do 10 damage. If I take that one, the, the seeking shot would do 5 damage to start with. Now if I shoot like that... Oh! Was already aiming on something. Nice! Now we gotta collect these sparkly stuff because that gives items let's hope we can reach those two yeah there we go and the last one before it triggers the alarm nope yes there we go now we get an item and i hope it's like healing yeah but it's only and help. You should be able to handle this. Doesn't look too bad. Wow, yeah, so I do a lot of more damage now thanks to that upgrade. Oh, still have to jump. Take less damage. Getting close. <laughs> oh. Done. Let's hope this paid off. So yeah, the hacking is a bit slower. Alarm Last time, I only had to kill two enemies. Then again, I didn't kill them this fast, I guess. So. And those drop five boxes or energy cubes so that's 50 for one enemy that's awesome yeah i'm almost at 1k again so i will be able to upgrade my damage quite soon which means my regular weapon will do 12 damage and my Seeking shot will do six. Yo, Yuriniko! Welcome back. Sorry, I totally missed you. I was so into the game. <laughs> How are you? Where do we go to activate? Oh, we have an enemy? Oh, yeah. Yeah. 
Yeah, already it seems to be gonna be a lot easier to kill stuff, which is nice. I don't even have to aim at them. And that's locked. So... Oh, we have a 3D printer room, so we're gonna go here and save. Ghost Boogan here. Best if you could scan yourself again. You've picked up new stuff, and it would be nice to have them next time your body is printed. Understood. I'll try to scan myself anytime I have new items. Wouldn't want to lose anything important. But what if I get destroyed before I can scan all the cool weapons or power-ups I've found? Try checking the wreckage of your last body, I suppose. You might be able to recover something. Oh, really, Reniko? Oh, yeah. I'm sorry for that. Uh, I know how that feels. Unfortunately. You just have to give it time. Lost mine in... Yeah, 15 years now. Whoa, bombs. Let's activate the alarm this time alarm also. I'll disable the alarm. You handle the welcoming. That yellow one we have to kill really fast because he's putting out a trail of gas damage here. from that one that's gonna give us an item so we gotta try to catch them there we go We get some good healing items, not just or well. I guess you can get like a weapon upgrades, and then we got a small and oh, dodge. Wasn't there like? Uh, although, can you explain this game a little more? Uh, like story and stuff? Yeah, dude. Um, <laughs> it's quite a funny story. Um, you have the Nakamura. That's the ship or place I'm at. Uh, let's see. Press down to crouch to roll. Press X key. Um, you are a ghost. Like, this is me. So I'm a ghost more or less, but I can take over robotics bodies. So uh, yeah, I don't really know where to start. <laughs> um, the thing is that there's a company that made some really good AI where robots learn things um, and become more and more human, except they don't have the limitations of a human do like anything and learn anything and there are two hackers that want to get the knowledge that's around 
to use it for good, I guess. So they have hired me um, to get in through this spaceship and steal the AI. So it's a Metrovania, it's like Super Metroid games like that, um, where you have to go around in a map, look for certain items to be able to progress in the game. So if you have played Super Metroid or some Castlevania games, uh, you have to find like double jump. I don't have that yet, but when I get double jump, I'm going to be able to jump around uh, and find more items. And yeah, so far the game is really nice. I enjoy it a lot. Uh, and also the humor in it is awesome. Uh, whoa, and there's bombs. <clears throat> in the beginning, uh, the two hackers that have hired me uh, use a voice modulation uh, to talk and communicate with me uh, to sound like a big corporation that had hired this girl or ghost. Uh, but they forgot to turn off their microphone when they were talking to each other, the two hackers, and she heard everything, so she now knows that. It's two hackers with a lot of money, so <laughs> that's about it. I just completed the tutorial and played through these rooms. So there's still stuff to do. And yes, yeah, someone outside is having fun with their moped. Yeah, there's one of the hackers. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm dead! Where is my health? Oh, it's broken! Oh, so I can't use the elevator when the alarm is off. 